Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to the channel. Uh, Jake here at Octane Freaks. Uh, in this video today, we have a battery charger review, I guess, or unboxing, or just showing you the product. Um, I bought this for my Mustang when I uh, store it in the wintertime because up here in the Midwest we get some intense weather in the wintertime so it gets pretty cold. Um, so I want to put a maintainer on my battery from now on. Uh, this is the NOCO Genius G7200. Um, sorry about the background noise, that's my, my little buggy Maverick. He's up there watching cartoons so. Um, so yeah, let's uh, let's get into the video. This is our first product showcase on the channel, so hopefully it's somewhat helpful to some people. Um, I picked this up on Amazon. I'll leave a link in the description for anybody who is interested. Uh, I found it to be the best place for the best price. Um, they offer many different models of this brand battery charger. Um, this is a 7200, so it's a 7.2 amp or 7200 milliamp. Uh, it does 12 volt charging, it does 24 volt charging, it does AGM batteries, it does lithium batteries. It does 12 volt repair, which I don't think I'd ever use that, but for someone that, you know, if you have a battery that's been sitting around for quite a while and you want to try to rebuild the cells in it, this battery charger says it can do it. So, and also a 13.6 volt supply. Um, that's, I'm guessing that's just a little bit more of a fast charge if you're trying to get it, get a car jumped. It's not a boost, booster pack or a jump pack for the battery, but gives you a little bit faster charge. Um, it's pretty self-explanatory. It comes with, comes with the uh, product information guide and limited warranty and your user guide. So it'll give you all explanation of each settings and everything like that. But it's pretty self-explanatory for being a battery charger um, in a compact design. It's not one of those big ones that you see a lot at like a Napa Auto Parts store, AutoZone, that you roll around, it's kind of like a dolly little thing. Um, I grew up around those with my dad and all that. So, But this one, you just plug it into your house outlet or garage outlet outside or bring the battery inside, however you want to do it. Um, go ahead and you just take the end here, plug it in, make sure it snaps. Negative lead, positive lead, and it'll start charging. Um, you just want to make sure you have it on the right setting, 12 volt, normal. Um, it'll click on the cold if it is cold outside if the battery's down to a certain temperature. Uh, it'll read 25, 50, 75 to 100 percent on the level of battery charge. I used it on my winter car to charge the battery because it sat for a couple weeks because I didn't drive it and it worked pretty good. And it comes with a battery terminal connector to keep this inside the vehicle at all times. So all you would have to do, pop the hood and Take your plug-in right here and plug it into the car, which I plan on doing with the Mustang. So I also bought an extension cable just in case. That's uh, that's another add-on, and I also bought the case, which is pretty nice. I mean, it gets a little crammed with everything in there, but it does zip close just fine. It's not putting any stress on the on the zipper, but. Um, yeah, buddy. This is my buggy. Is that my buggy? Yeah. Sorry. Um, but yeah, link in the description. Um, that's pretty much all I have for you. I'm not gonna really, I'm not gonna go put it out on the car. Um, I apologize. But it's it's pretty self-explanatory if you're looking for something. And Genius Renoco also makes boost packs and um, bigger ones too for uh, diesels, 
more amperage for diesel batteries if you're doing dual batteries or whatnot. So there's if there's something more that you're looking for, you definitely can find it within Amazon. And like I said, I found this to be found Amazon to be the best price. It also has a kind of a cool feature that it comes with these little holes black here. I don't know if you can see them, but um, you can mount it to the wall too. So if you are an individual that stores your car in your third stall and you kind of got a little, you know, third stall car automotive setup, you know, with your tools, toolbox or whatever, you can mount this to the wall and you could just have, you know, whatever connector, these sitting there just waiting. Sorry. There we go. These right here. So sit inside underneath the hood and you can take your extension cord, you know, wound it up on the wall, pull it off type of deal. So then you're not just lugging this big thing around. Um, it worked pretty good for mine. It, uh, it'll show the percent of charge. If you have a completely dead battery, it won't, it won't show anything. It'll just show that it's on. But once it hits 25, 50, so on and so forth. And then the best part of it, like I said, it's a charger and a maintainer. So once it gets to 100%, it'll drop the amperage down to maintain the battery and not overcharge it. So it's a very good battery if it's dead and you're gonna be leaving the car for a while, you can leave it on there and it won't continuously charge the battery. It'll just maintain the battery and have it ready for you whenever you're ready to drive the vehicle. So. But other than that, that's all I really have. Um, any other questions or anything, leave, leave comments if anybody wants to. More than, more than welcome to do that. Um, if, uh, if you want to support the channel, we'd really appreciate it. Subscribe, uh, hit the notification bell, um, uh, share the videos. Uh, we haven't really been saying that on the other ones uh, that would really help too um, we'll be bringing more and more content we're gonna try to get more videos out but it's gonna be kind of tough because it's coming towards the end of the end of the year here and the cars will be in storage I know I haven't shown my Mustang on the channel yet but there's some personal issues with that that it'll probably be coming out next season so um, but my partner in crime, Carl, he has a car to reveal to the channel too, not just the truck. So we'll have that content for you guys to watch. And um, we're also coming up with some merchandise ideas too. Uh, if anybody would be interested in it, let us know. Um, to help support the channel, get our name out there so we can you know, keep building and get better content. So, but I appreciate everybody's time. Welcome to the channel if you're your first timer. I'm Jake. Have a good evening. Peace out.